Okay guys, I'm back in Garena Speed Drifters. In this video, I'm going to review the that I got in the GSTCC account that I don't have first. Eh? So, first off, it will be Dreadnought. Let's review Dreadnought first. So, for Dreadnought, uh, it's a battle car, meaning it's uh, competitive. And a mini boost is given when recovering. Recovering means when you press the reset button. And 20 seconds later, Basic power increases by 40% Okay, so it's not only you get a mini boost But for 20 seconds after your restart You get uh, basic power And by states you can see it's like a B car <laughs> Everything is quite bad But let's full mod first Okay, so the full mod is right and left Right, left And as usual, no infinity chip yet Infinity chip got a lot eh? But we'll see how strong is it without infinity chip first Okay, so normal speed is 198.3 Double boost 240.2 CWW 303.9 Wow, it's not that strong at all <laughs> WCW 287.2 And WCWW mm, 304.2 can't be that low 308.1 Okay, 308.1 Let me just confirm one more time Nope, that's not it Yeah, okay, 308.1 Now, if I reset Yeah, I got a mini boost And let's see if I do see the W again It's still the same So speed doesn't increase Just basic power It means acceleration For 20 seconds If I reset now it refreshes, okay. So every time I reset, there's a 20 second uh, basic power buffer. So basically, if you did a mistake, uh, if you did a mistake, or if you're playing item, it's a camera. <laughs> but 303.9 is very slow. So let's put infinity chip in there. Eh? If you can see, there's a lot of buffs for Dreadnought. Top speed plus 2.1, wow. Basic power plus 6, charge time plus 8, max mini boost 1.4, quick boost time plus 2%, mini boost power plus 6, nitro max speed plus 1.3, nitro power plus 2, collision weight plus 200, and something minus 5 there. So, a tier 7 car with infinity chip, let's see how strong is it eh? But before that, double check, yes it's right and left. So, from uh, 303.9, how much is it now? First, normal speed. 200.3, reach 200. Double boost, 243.4. Okay, let's see, see that W. 308.2, wow, from 303 to 308. WCW, 290.9. This one heavily buffed. WCW, W, 311.2. Oh no, 312.5 Yes, 312.5 And if I reset I get a mini boost eh? Because of its reset ability, I see it's an item car lah. More, more of an item car. Anyway, uh, Dreadnought test track is Dragon Bay. Okay, Dragon Bay is actually an item map. Eh? <laughs> Should I really test Dragon Bay? Ah, why not? Okay, I know this is an item map, but I'll play like it's speed mode. Eh? This is gonna be a bit weird. Can I get, uh, yeah. Can I just, uh, <laughs> yeah, like that. Okay.
how else will you play speed mode like this? <laughs> Wow, 1 minute 10 <laughs> 1 minute 12 Well, that wasn't an actual speed mode eh? well, Let me just, let me, let's actually play speed mode right now Okay, first game, uh, quick race of Oh, 390. Exactly. Ah, oh, thank goodness. Okay. So now we're gonna play rank solo speed. Thanks to Zoe. Thanks to Zoe, we get matches. Actually, I reset on purpose. <laughs> a few mistakes, but you saw that if I reset, I get a uh, hey, hey, mini booster. Eh? <laughs> oh yeah, this account uh, diamond four now. Eh? 
Okay, because last time advancement. Okay guys, uh, I'm doing a short video only eh, for Dreadnought. So yeah, tier 7 car really uh, buffed a lot eh, from 303, went up to 308. But still, uh, turning and end tank is not strong. Eh. The others are okay, you can see the estates are from up there. So from just now, everything was so weak and till now, power, thruster, drift and speed is uh, buffed a lot. Eh. <laughs> I'll review straight away, wait together, lah. better review together, make it one video. So just now it was Dreadnought, next we'll review the next voucher car from supplies would be Flash lah, I think I'll review Flash first. So Flash is a car that has a catch up effect eh? uh, Increase catch up effect by 30% So if you're not at uh, first place, you have a catch up effect uh, Increase by 30% This was a voucher car in GST but in QQ it was only a supplies car Supplies gacha and a box I think if I'm not mistaken Yeah but now the only way to get flash is uh, from supplies eh? Last time it was a voucher car So uh, full modding for this is right and left And straight away let's test this one out also Alright so normal speed is 198.9 Double boost is 240.7 CWW is 304.6 Let me check one more time Yeah, okay, confirm 304.6 And WCW 287.8 WCWW 306.9 308.7, yeah, 308.7 Okay, so this car is slightly faster than Dreadnought But without Infinity Chip eh. But is it uh, as strong as Dreadnought? Or better than Dreadnought if I put Infinity Chip? Let's see The buffs are quite a lot eh? Also Alright Check the modding This is right and left eh? Okay, correct So now let's check with Infinity Chip Uh, 200? Yes, 200.8 Faster Then Dreadnought 244.5 for double boost CW From 304 307 Ah, lesser than Dreadnought Yeah, 307.9 Okay, it's lesser than Dreadnought WCW 290.4 WCWW 309.2 Really? I don't think so 312.3 Okay 312.3 Yes And the test track for this Space Station Really? Okay Space Station then Why Flash is Space Station? <laughs> I guess it's for battle uh, Competitive 
my small for ketchup. Definitely, I'm gonna play ranked if I'm gonna use flash. <laughs> This PlayStation much already. Hey. Yeah, you can you can tell that I lost practice already. All right, we're in rank and we get Colon Cathedral. All right, let's go. I'm gonna give myself five seconds, eh? So that I can get the catch-up effect. <laughs> Since this is a catch-up effect car, more of a comeback car. Five seconds. All right. All right. Let's see you accidentally. One, two, three. Look at the speed. Up to you, Eddie. Oh, no. Already second. <laughs> oh no. Oh. Even five seconds. Eh? <laughs> Managed to get second. Oh, we have an NPC. Oh wait, my NPC might not be loading. It's loading too slow. Hold up. Um, I'm using Wi-Fi. It should be loading fast. Come on. Ni unify ni masalah ni. Dang it. Am I not in the room? I think they started already. Okay, second flash game. Just now the NPC cannot load, so that didn't count. Eh? This time we're not doing the five second wait. Eh? Oh. 
I think if I do the 5 second wait as well, I'll still finish about the same time. <laughs> I think that boost. Eh? Oh, I just realized the uh my pet and ECU is off. Am I? I thought something was weird. Oh, we got first. No problem. And I'm already what? Uh, diamond for 30 points. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna wait 3 seconds this time. Ah, Mystic City. Same like that time. And <laughs> and Zen is using Challenger some more. Oh boy, okay. 3 seconds, eh? this time 3 seconds. One, two, three. Thirty seconds. Oh no. <sighs> Can't always make it to pull everything. Ah, oh, like I didn't get the. Ah. No, <laughs> I made a mistake. Dang it. All right, I think enough for flash. Well, then I guess I'll move on to the next car, which is Gambu. Gambu has a very bad drift. You can look at the states there. And it keeps end tank 40% when crashing into a wall and increase base speed plus 12%. This is a car I skipped but somehow I got permanent from supplies. <laughs> and yeah, uh, I already full mod this. Let's do this quickly. Without infinity chip, uh, modding right, right and right. Eh? So yeah, let's test without infinity chip first. So the normal speed for Gambo is 199.2. Double boost 241.1 CWW 303.2 That's like serious speed eh? WCW 286.4 Is it really? 303.2 Hold on Wait Yeah 303.2 Okay so W C W W. Ah no way. Three zero seven point four. Okay. Wow, this car is as low as serious, eh? But with Infinity Chip, there is something feature here. I don't know what is it, but there's a lot of buffs here. Let's put this in. All Renault. I just realized. Dreadnought, Flash, and Genbu. All three are Renault cars. 
<laughs> okay, and confirm the modding. Is everything right? Yes, they're all right. So now, the normal speed is 201.2, faster than the other two. No, double boost to 44.5 and CW for 300 fish. 308. Okay, it's like dreadnought, like I see. WCW 290.9. It's now 308.2, eh? CW. And WCW W 312.5. Okay. 308.2. Alright. So what is this uh, test track? Penguin Island. Okay, first game we'll test this on Penguin Island. Okay, for Gambo I need some difficult map. No, that's not a difficult map, but okay. <laughs> Still using Challenger. <laughs> My city stylish. Still the highest uh, style points even though using C car. <laughs> Alright. Hey. Gambo used to be heavy and quite bad eh? But this one, after Infinity Chip, feels totally different One, two, three, four Okay. 
can uh, sign it finish yes finish <laughs> nice using challenger oh, already halfway already la, la, no more train station come on <laughs> we get this again every single race we get this map I didn't mean to do that. This one is like Renault but not uh, as uh, heavy as Renault. No impact collision. 40% uh, saving and tank, not collision though. <laughs> Autumn story please. Uh, that's the only map that's banned. That is it. Uh, okay. Alright, last game eh. Nice, but dang it. <laughs> I got full natural but I got hit. Lucky got 40% safe. And thanks. Yeah, so serious to be there. Yeah, I don't need to keep drift even. That should be enough. 51. I pushed a lot also for rank. <laughs> Thank you, Zoe and Sunny. Again, if not, I couldn't find any rank games. Alright, so this one I'll just uh, summarize both. Uh... Where's Flash? Okay, for Flash, yeah. Flash is a good catch up effect car. Was it really 30%? I thought it was 20. 20, 25? 30, yeah. All this time. Okay, 30%, eh? So Flash is a comeback car, if you're not first, this uh, catch up effect will increase by 30%. Every time there's a catch up effect, you just don't know it. <laughs> Actually, if you are 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th or at the back, you always have a catch up effect. 
but this one they all cast behind first place get a catch get a catch up effect but this car flash or oh, i don't know why i call it thunder ranger here will have a stronger version of this effect so that's the characteristic it just has a better catch up effect compared to other cars slower than dreadnought and uh, Gambus CW for CW lah. For CW is slower, but the others are faster. But doesn't matter. Flash should be even more faster if you are at the back. <laughs> okay, so it's a comeback car. For Ganbu, yeah. Uh, if it, I realize this replacing characteristics thing eh, happens if you have uh, this thing over here, the features thing. But I don't understand what the features does. <laughs> I'm pretty sure uh, the features will change the ability or improve the ability even more but uh, in GST the ability is bug eh? it, it's now numbers <laughs> so there's a bug in its uh, characteristics after putting infinity chip for some cars eh? but yeah for gamble originally it was uh, you you were save 40% and tank if you hit a wall and what was it I kind of forgot <laughs> But uh, uh, but its drift is too big, eh? it didn't buff its drift But the others are much better, slightly And its speed also uh, similar with Dreadnought So I said uh, Dreadnought, Flash and Gambu Dreadnought was tier 7, Flash and Gambu tier 6 All 3 of them went up to tier, I don't know, 4 maybe? <laughs> so they, they are buff uh, a bit better lah so that's my triple review for Dreadnought, Flash and Gambu. Where to get Flash and Dreadnought is in supplies and Gambu also. All three are here. But uh, for Gambu, was it Gambu? Yeah, if for Gambu, you don't want to get it from supplies because supplies very difficult. The other option is you can get it from Wishing Well. Wishing Well also can. Uh, get gamble all right so that's another option i say i say wishing well is better <laughs> if you want to get gamble wishing well is better to get but they are actually better cars than gamble all right okay so that's it for this triple review uh mainly this three a cars uh, from supplies ah done review for this so thank you guys for watching see you guys next time